City Chronicles Shadow of Deceit by Anubunwa Obifuel Chigazi In the heart of Lagos, Nigeria, a tale of ambition, deception, and resilience unfolds. This is the story of Ao, a brilliant app developer, his sister Ngozi, a cybersecurity expert, and their fight against a shadowy cyber criminal network led by the elusive Baron. Finally, the update is ready. This new feature is going to revolutionize our app. You've outdone yourself, Aor. This is going to bring in the big box. The long expected Naira, dollar, and pounds will start dropping soonest. My god, you don't blow. Just imagine, your app used by millions. Yeah, it's like everything we've worked for is finally coming together. Hey? How did you get the funding for this latest push anyway? It must have cost a fortune, or you got funded by President Tinubu. An anonymous investor, they reached out through email and seemed really interested in the app's potential. They wired the funds almost immediately. Anonymous investor? That sounds a bit sketchy, don't you think? Relax, Chinadu. It's probably some tech enthusiast who sees the potential. Nothing to worrying about. Ao, a young and talented app developer, believes he's on the verge of success. However, he's unaware that this update contains a malicious Trojan, Brokewell. Ayer, I've been looking into some of the reports about your app. Something's not right. I found strange activities linked to it. It's like, it's siphoning off data from users' devices. You worrying too much, Ngozi. It's just a few bugs. I'll patch them up in no time. Ayer, I'm serious. Let me dig deeper into the code. Please. We can't afford to take risks, especially with user data. It's fine. Fine. Do what you have to, but I'm sure it's nothing. Okay? Let's see what's really going on here. Ayo, hey, Ngozi is right. This is more than just a bug. There's a Trojan embedded in the update. It's called Brokewell. It can steal credentials and give remote access to the device. How is that possible? I checked everything. This can't be happening. It's happening. We need to act fast before more people get affected. We have to inform the users and roll back the update. But how? If we go public with this, it'll ruin us. We need to find a way to fix it quietly. Quietly. Ayer, this isn't just about us anymore. People's lives could be affected. We have to do the right thing. This could be the story of a lifetime. An app developer caught in a web of cyber crime. Let us see where this leads. I downloaded the update and soon after, my bank account was drained. I'm so sorry to hear that. Can you tell me more about what happened right before you noticed the breach? I don't know how it happened. I just updated the app and started getting strange messages. I didn't think much of it until my bank called. Thank you for your time. I'll get to the bottom of this. Your story will help prevent this from happening to others. As Kemi digs deeper, she starts connecting the dots, uncovering a much larger and more dangerous plot. Welcome to my world, Ayu. Did you really think you could outsmart me? Now, you will help me expand my network. I'll never help you. Oh, but you already have. 
Your app is now a tool in my arsenal. And you, my dear Ayo, are just the beginning. The Baron reveals his true intentions, turning Ayo's world upside down. We need to get Ayo and Chinidu out of there. Here's the plan. We create a diversion at the front entrance while Femi and I sneak in through the back. We'll hit them hard and fast. No mistakes. Our priority is getting them out safely. We're coming. You are too late, are you? My network is everywhere. This ends now. You can't stop me. Not if we have anything to say about it. We've already disabled your main servers. You're under arrest, Baron. This is over. Thrilling confrontation, Ao and his team expose the Baron and bring him to justice. Ao learns the importance of cybersecurity and resilience. We did it, but this is just the beginning. We need to ensure this never happens again. And we will, together. We'll build stronger defenses and educate others. In the face of deception, only vigilance and teamwork can protect our digital world. Subscribe, like, and click on the notification bell to discover more enchanting stories from the heart of the African wilderness. This is the lesson of Shadow of Deceit. Stay safe, stay aware. <laughs> if water kill your child, now what are you good? Lord